This high rated puzzle is one of the puzzles along my way to reaching 3200 in puzzles. The puzzle is not that difficult that its rating suggests, but it's quite deceptive and this is why many failed. First move is clear, we want to restrict the king and second move as well, it's clear. The king is very restricted now. Here is where everybody failed. What is the plan? We want to mate the king at g7 and maybe some scenarios at h7, depending on the move of black. How to reach to g7? Can you tell me what are available squares that keep our queen next move to g7? Right, there are two squares. One is f8, another one is c7. Now it's decision time, where to go? Let's see what is the counterplay of black. Black's only counterplay is to give a check with the rook. And for the, after that, our king has no option but to go up. Our king has two options, g2 or h2. g2 is clearly bad, takes pawn with check and then brings the queen maybe or sacrifices the rook or whatever crazy move he can. So we should go to h2 clearly. What's bad about h2? What makes a difference here? Once we go h2, black queen has a chance to give a check at e5. So how to prevent that? And at the same time bring our queen to g7? Right, go to c7 and black loses on a spot. 